Hello everyone, this is Char with Char's Art from the Heart. We're going to make a little uh, Christmas ornament that you can put on your tree or use in a tiered tray if you like. This is a beautiful um, assortment of Santa Claus faces that I got from Decoupage Central. I decided to use the water pen and just tear this one out because I'm going to put it on the front of this piece of wood that I've painted white. And instead of using uh, Mod Podge, I'm just going to use a glue stick and I just apply it to the back of the rice paper and glue it down and y'all, it worked great. That's the first time I've ever tried that. And I, I went ahead and dried it a little bit, smoothed it out. It really did not wrinkle up on me, but I was afraid that it might. So I went ahead and smoothed it out with my brayer. And now I am taking this piece of scrapbook paper. And you're going to see that I am uh, actually putting the lines on the back because this is going to be like a busted canvas, although it's not a canvas. I am just using the white uh, wooden board and this scrapbook paper. And let me show you how I'm doing this. I am just going to glue this to the top. And yes, I don't have a, um, Another side for the outside, but that's okay because I decided to do something else to it. And I was hoping the blue inside would help bring some of the blue out in the picture with Santa Claus. I don't think it helped very much, but it was still okay. I like the idea of the Christmas music on there and it worked out really pretty good. So. I decided it needed something though on the front, so I got my uh, Brilliance Tim Holtz gold ink pad out and got a little sponge and was going all over the front of it. It really looks yellow in this picture. And y'all, I apologize for the lighting on here. I thought I had it fixed, but obviously I don't. I'm going to be working on that today though. So I put the gold all the way around and it looks pretty spotted here, but it's not, it's just the lighting. And I decided I wanted to, um, I was gonna fancy it up and then I decided, no, let's antique it a little bit. So I got some more ink out and um, decided to use that on top of the gold and you can't tell in this picture but it really turned out pretty because that brilliant gold just shines through um, this ink that I'm using over it. It doesn't make it look that old or anything but it just gives it a different textured look so then I decided I would fancy it up a little bit. It needed a trim, and I found my little um, sparkle trim and decided to put that all the way around it. And then I thought, oh, we need more color. So I added some green uh, little cedar pieces that I wanted to put on there. and. I need red somewhere. But before I did that, I found my clear glue and I put it around, just a string of it around the heart, around Santa Claus's face, and I added uh, diamond dust to it. You can't tell in this picture, but it really, really made a difference. So I'm just going ahead and putting um, my sparkle around the side pieces of this board. So it's going to be a little bit country and a little bit rock and roll. There we go. 
I'm just about finished with it. Got my red on there, got my red berries, and there's my Santa. I hope that y'all will look at the picture and see how it turned out. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you uh, following my page, and I will see you again. Thank you.